Good afternoon from um from Kaukong. number three Pinya. Yes, good afternoon. How are you today? Good afternoon, teacher. Good afternoon. Today we're going to learn health and occupation. Okay. Good afternoon, teacher. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, teacher. Good afternoon. Uh, let's wait for the others, okay? Good afternoon from um, Pan Pan, Port, Remy, Port again. Good afternoon, good afternoon, good afternoon. Good afternoon to all of you. All right. <coughs> Sorry. Uh. <coughs> Shut it up. <laughs> what are you doing, huh? What? No, 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 no. Look at that. Yeah. Many friends. Hi, friends. Okay. Good afternoon, everyone. Now we are third at uh, twenty seven. Hello. So. Hello. Hello. This is Julia. Hello. 
Hello. <laughs> Good afternoon, teacher. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon, everyone. That's right. You have to greet you your friends too. Twenty-six. Today is August eighteen, Wednesday. Hello, Tisha Julia. Hello. Today we're going to learn health. Okay, we, we're going to use health workbook. Okay. Uh, get ready your health. Yes. 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 Yes.
Elsa, how are you today? Yes. Yes. Um, health, health. I will tell you later. Page ten. Okay, so I okay. We are forty two, forty one. Oh, where are the others now? Okay, so are you ready? Yes. 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 Okay. Yes. So, yes. Uh, all right. So, good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to our online class. So today we're going to learn health. 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 Yes. Health. So let's start. All right, are you ready? Yes. 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 Okay, so you said you're ready. So let's start our lesson today. So today is Wednesday, 18th of August, 2021. So welcome to our online class with teacher Juliet. So today's lesson, we will learn about unit four, basic movements. Okay. Basic movements. So lesson one, it's about locomotor movements. Okay. Uh, you've learned this one when you are in grade uh, when you were in grade one. So I hope that you don't forgot. You didn't forget what you've learned when you were in grade one. So yeah. Wait a minute. All right. So, teacher, you ready? Teacher, you ready? Teacher, you ready? Teacher, Teacher, you ready? Teacher, you ready? Okay. All right. Okay, okay. Let's learn about basic movements. They are locomotor and non-locomotor movements. Do you know the difference between the locomotor and non-locomotor movements? Locomotor movements are movements that require the body to move from one place to place or change direction. While the non-locomotor movements are movements that do not require the body to move from one place to place or change direction. Here are the examples of locomotor movements. Walking. Walking involves movements of the legs in a series of steps. 
You can walk forward, backward, or sideways. Walking. Running. Running involves movements of the legs at a speed faster than walking. You always run forwards. Running. Skipping. Skipping involves stepping and hopping with the same foot. You can skip on either your left or right foot. Skipping. Jumping. Jumping involves springing and then landing on both feet. You can jump up and down on the same spot. You can also jump forward, backward, or sideways. Jumping. Leaping. Leaping is a jump from one point to another or a sudden or large movement or transition. Leaping. Here are the examples of non-locomotor movements. Stretching. Stretching involves extending a part of your body. You can stretch your arms upwards or sideways. You can also stretch your legs forwards or backwards. Stretching. Swinging. Swinging is moving a part of your body back and forth. You can swing your arms and legs. Swinging. Bending. Bending involves arching or moving a part of your body. You can bend forwards, backwards, or sideways. You can also bend your head, knees, and arms. Bending. Pushing. You can do push-ups. To do push-ups, your hands and toes are on the floor with the body and legs in a straight line. Then lower and raise yourself. Pushing. Lifting. Lifting involves moving a part of your body upwards to a higher level. You can raise your arms and you can lift your leg. Lifting. Locomotor movements. Walking. Leaping. Jumping. Skipping. Running. These are locomotor movements. Non-locomotor movements. Stretching. Swinging. Bending. Pushing. Lifting. These are non-locomotor movements. I hope you enjoy and learn something today. So now, that was the video of locomotor and non-locomotor movements. Now, it's time to read the vocabulary, okay? Please read with me, but you don't need to turn on your microphone. So just turn off your microphone, but you have to repeat after me, okay? So, what is locomotor movement? So, locomotor movement. L-O-C-O-M-O-T-O-R. M-O-V-E. M-E-N-T. Locomotor movement. So, locomotor movements are movements that require our body to move from one place or change direction. For example, take a look at the picture. So the girl is from here and then he is stepping and hopping and then he ch she changes direction and she moves, okay? She is moving forward. So that is an example of locomotor movements. Now let's learn another examples of locomotor movements. Okay. 
For example, walking, walking, W A L K I N G, walking. From the word walk, learn, walking. So, what is walking? Walking involves movement of the legs in a series of steps in any direction. Okay? You can work, you can walk forwards, backwards, or sideways. Will I learn? Learn, 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 sideways. Okay? So, you change directions, you move. Okay? So, another example of locomotor is running running when you run so you move from this place to another place so what is running running is the movement of the legs at a speed faster than walking so running is faster than walking okay so you always run forward so when we run, we will run forwards. Okay. Next example of locomotor movements is hopping. Hopping. H O P P I N G. H O P P I N G. Hopping. What is hopping? So, hopping involves springing on one foot and then landing on the same foot. So you can hop on either your left or right foot. So at this, you start hopping where, with one foot and then you spring, you jump with the same foot, okay? And then landing on the same foot. Hopping. You use your only one foot, your only foot, okay? You use only one foot by hopping, all right? Hopping. This is hopping. Next example is skipping. Skipping. S-K-I-P-P-I-N-G. S-K-I-P-P-I-N-G. I N G. So, skipping. So, what is skipping? Skipping is stepping and hopping with the same foot. So, you step and then hop with the same foot. So, for example, this girl is step and then hop, hop with the same foot. Okay? So, Another example of skipping is when using a skipping rope. When you play skipping rope. So, okay, your foot is skipping when you jump over the skipping rope. Okay? So, this is skipping. Next, toe step walking. So, toe step walking. Uh, Nakriyan, we have one minute left. I don't know why we have we just started. So we have less than a minute. So if the Zoom stop, please come back in. Okay. Yeah, ถ้ามันตัดไปนักเรียนเข้ามาใหม่นะคะโอเคนะโอเคค่ะเราใช้ยี่สิบนาทีโอเคค่ะโอเคค่ะเราใช้ลิงก์เดิมไหมคะหรือใช้ลิงก์ใหม่ค่ะใช้ลิงก์เดิมค่ะลิงก์เดิมได้เลยค่ะ same ค่ะ the same alright so we have less than a minute so two step walking so what is two step walking two step walking involves stepping one foot forwards bringing the other one beside it okay you can